So make a notes, all of you. Right. Okay. So Vinci Mall has uh, two names. Bless Joe's. Very good. Harshil. Second name, please. Okay, Harshil left. No problem. So two names. Others, all others have two names. That's very good. Right. So what I ask you is. Right. So I'm joining here to observe your comments from my mobile, so write down your comments. What are your problems with regard to? So this is, uh, Conversations are fast, bit tricky to understand and follow. I have difficulty in understanding their pronunciation. Listen, understand, and write up is a difficult, says Vinci Mole Thomas. Very good, Vinci. Your comment is appreciated, and I'll give you suggestions. Good, Vinci Mole. Yeah, that's appreciated. So, you have given your comment, you have responded to the Grandmaster class points. That's really appreciated. So, all of you can mention your problems. Mention your problems. Listening. Listening. Yeah. Part B. So, Listening part B, submit your problems. Submit your problems regarding, okay, part B, listening. Yes, there you go. Submit your problems regarding part B. Listening, yes. So, mention your problems. I want each and every one because I'm going to discuss these points. I'll be telling you, yeah, I'll be telling you. And I'm even going live in YouTube directly. They tell you the points there. So that's fine. Right. So we have gone live. Yes. So write down, Vinci, first I will attend because you're very sincerely you submitted your point. I just asked you and you submitted your point and it will not go unnoticed. The answer will be given you, given to you. 
So I'll be responding to your problems, everything today. Yes. The four comments have come here. That's awesome. So is this, uh, Bless Joe says, at times I'm unable to choose the right answer in three options. That's a wonderful, it's Bless Joe's. Okay. Bless. Okay. Noted your problem. I'm going to explain you why it is a difficult over there. Yes, that's fine. Bless. At times, you're able to understand. At times, you're not able to select the right option. That means at particular in particular situations. Can't understand conversation. Sangeeta Patel because of very fast and sometimes difficulties to listen. Yes, Sangeeta Patel. No, Sangeeta Patel. Yes. Sangeeta Patel. Okay, noted. Your difficulty. Yeah, we are going to answer that question. So noted your difficulty, that's good. The next one. Uh, yes, noted. Then CG Jason, I have the same problem Vince said. Yes, so that's fine. So your question is asked. So we are going to respond. Yes. CG Jason. Noted your request. Yes, noted your request. Fine, that's fine. CG Jason. Uh, the next one. Seema Gupta says sometimes their pronunciation and understanding their language. This is Seema Gupta. Seema Gupta. Seema Gupta. Yes, note it down. Yeah, pronunciation is a point in question. Noted down your point. Yes. So, very good. We have got some points at 50 students are there already. Yes. The main question. Okay, the main question is, main question now going on. Okay. The current question. The current question or the current concern, we can say not question, it is a concern. The current concern. Okay. What? Okay, so what are your problems regarding listening? Test part B. Okay, what are your problems? Okay, regarding listening test part B. So this is the question. This is the question. So, so you are right. Okay, mention in there, or you can say respond. Respond in the chat box. Respond in 
the chat box. Respond in the chat box. Yeah. Respond in the chat box. Your questions, your problems will be discussed. Your problems will be discussed. So go ahead and give your problems because I'll give only five minutes time. After that, we are going to start the discussion. What are your problems regarding listening test part B? Respond in the chat box. Your problems will be solved, discussed. Yes, the current cancer. So all the discussions, whatever it is, whatever tough topic it is, just to present it there. And we are going to discuss. Definitely, we are going to discuss. Definitely, we are going to discuss these problems. Okay. We are going to discuss these problems definitely. last two minutes and be ready with your pens and papers the explanations will blow your minds and be ready One minute more.
here. All right, if anybody is interested, just to get back to me, because we have openings for graduates. And if anybody is in need of employment, I need some uh, online uh, assistance. I need some online assistance. The salary will be 12,000 per month initially, which will be increased. They're not going to do anything. I will post some message that will be posted in the groups and other areas. That's it, because I don't have time to go with all these things. I'm going to give you an opportunity if anybody is interested or see what videos or anything, even if it's a nurse or anybody, okay? If anybody is interested, you can go for this and uh, I'll add you into the groups and we just have to send you to the other groups, that's all. Because many people want to join these sessions, but I cannot post them, so they are not able to join. That's the point. Okay. So if anybody is interested like that, you can get back to me. Right. So the first question. So the first question is of Bincy Mall. So this is Bincy Mall's question. Ben Simol Thomas, a nurse from India. Okay, this is the question of Ben Simol from India. Okay, right. The question is here. I told you already, I promised you that I will explain each and every question, your problem, and it will be definitely discussed. It will definitely be discussed. No doubt regarding that. No doubt regarding that. Everything will be discussed in detail. Yes, Mr. Peter is here. Fine. And where is the lecture? Is the slide? Yeah. Okay, that's fine. Yes. Yeah. Dr. Farid says, good question. Yeah, Anvi Jacob, I got your request. You're going to attend all the exams it's noted and i'll talk to you okay, get back to me personally yes i remember just now so the first question here is of a bincy mole bincy mole thomas So Bincy Moore, the computer is telling there are some mistakes. Let me correct. Conversations are fast. So after comma, you have to put a space. Conversations are fast. Okay. Bit too tricky to understand and follow. So and bit tricky. A bit tricky to understand and follow. Full stop. I have difficulty. I have difficulty in understanding their pronunciation. After full stop, you have to put a space. Okay. Their pronunciation. So understand their pronunciation. So what is the problem? Nothing is there. Listen, understand and a write up write up is hyphenated a writing up so we'll listen understand and write up so listening understanding and writing up how can you say is difficult are difficult listen understand and write up three things are there so you have to say are difficult not is difficult 
Okay. So this is how things will be there. So this is the question of a bit more Thomas. Yes, Binsimul Thomas, your question, your doubt, your problem and your concern is quite a general. Conversations are fast. Where lies the problem? Where is the problem? Is this your problem? Or this, is this everyone's problem? Or is this not a problem at all? If this is a problem, I'm talking to you as a language specialist, not just as an OET teacher. I don't know, I feel very sad when I say I'm an OET teacher because every Tom Dick and Harry is an OET teacher these days. So I don't feel very happy to say that I'm an OET teacher. So that's why I can say I'm a language specialist because I'm a language specialist. I'm not just a teaching OET. I can teach anything related to English. So in that power, in that position, I can tell you all these things. The first thing is conversations or of three types, according to speed. It's not the speed here, it is fluency that matters. So what you are asking a question is not a genuine question at all. So you are questioning actually not on the speed of the conversation, but it is the fluency of the conversation. You don't know that you are asking in a different way. The speakers are very fluent and they drift their words like that. So speakers are of three different types based on their fluency. Some speakers have excellent fluency, so it appears that they are speaking very fast. And some speakers are moderate, so it is not very difficult to follow them. You can manage to go with them and their pronunciation patterns. And the last one is, there are some speakers who have less fluency. They don't speak very fast. So it is very easy to gel with those, to gel means to adjust with such a speaking patterns. For example, when I am speaking now, it's very easy to follow because my fluency is very low. I'm not speaking very fast. I'm not speaking moderate, but I'm speaking and a slow pace, no, I'm speaking with low fluency level. Fluency means just rushing. So the question you're asking is not about the fast conversations, but it is about the fluency in the level of conversation. There is nothing called fast, medium or slow, nothing. You're speaking very fast, no, he's very fluent and speaks very fast, that's, that's the fluency. Now, what the point is, why I am faced, yeah, you ask the questions, I am not able to follow. I am not able to follow. You have two questions here. First one is conversations are fast. That means you are blaming the conversation there. The point is, when you're saying the screw is loose, the screw is loose. And that's why there is a creaking sound in your chair. So the screw is loose. That means there is a problem. The problem is not in the screw. 
The problem is not in the screw. The screw has nothing to do with being loose. Now, only the thing is you are attempted to make it tight is important. Try to understand what I'm telling you. Differential approach. Instead of saying the conversations are fast, then if you look into the other way and think like that, the screw is loose. That means the screw should be tight. When you say the screw is loose, it implies that the screw must be tight. That is implied, the implication is understood. So you are seeing from a different angle, but you are not going to imply the sense of the essence. Conversations are fast. For whom? For you. So what you have to do? Enhance, empower, strengthen yourself. Conversation will not change. It is unchangeable. It is called a standard. The screw is a standard. Screw will always be a screw only. Screw, there is nothing wrong in the screw. The problem is in you who is leaving it alone. Let it be like that. I have no problem. Or let me set it right. And I will fit the screw properly. So it is in the attitude. The change should be there in our attitude. My brother, if he sees the screw, it is loose, he will not bother. But if I see the screw that it is loose, I will take a screwdriver and immediately fix it. The way how you are approaching the problem, actually it is not a problem at all. The problem, you are facing the problem. You are facing the problem. So what it is, you say to yourself, and change your attitude to that one particular one. So take a screwdriver and fix it. Now what is this screwdriver and fixing? Now you increase your speed. That's it. Now how to increase the speed? Let me tell you one thing. Because many people don't understand what is the problem actually. The problem is not... Uh, the problem is... See, for example, beauty lies in the eyes of the beholder. Beauty lies in the eyes of the beholder. For example, you see somebody with a twisted hand or a twisted lip or some problem and you may tell, oh, this boy is ugly. You are looking only about the twisted hand. What about the full body? Is there any problem in the 90% of 95% of the body? There is no problem. Then why don't you see the 95%? Instead of that, you will say, oh, he has a twisted hand. He has a cleft palate. or a fat nose, or a hanging ears. So this is the problem. So you are seeing only about the conversation, but the beauty, you're not thinking about the fluency of the person who is speaking. That means the person who is speaking is an expert. Why don't you understand that the person who is doing the conversation is an expert, he's going at a wonderful rapid pace. You should actually Appreciate the quality of speech, his pronunciation, his pattern, his uh, um, rhyming, his, uh, um, you know, intonation, his fluency, his power, his vocabulary, his standard, his impressive style. Mind you, once you see these things, automatically you will have a burning desire to speak like him, to follow him, to become a speaker like that. Instead of seeing the positive things, you are seeing the negative things. So this is called negative approach. 
instead of it's actually a blame in some other person it's a blame game and we are habituated even i tell like that it's called blame game you can't do it so blame it a fox which tried to catch the grapes when it could not catch it blames the grapes what the grapes are sour and it goes its way so this is called the blame game instead of blaming the grapes it can say oh it is my weakness and i cannot reach the grapes it is my weak area so what i should do i should do something else it should realize that it is its own weakness we have to change so we have to say be positive be positive mr simon yes be positive is my blood group i am positive so why should i not be positive so if i am positive then i will start learning these things so we have a drawback conversations are not fast conversations will always be like that if you say conversations are fast that means you are blaming the conversations you are blaming the speaker who is speaking and you are blaming the uh, oet test you are blaming the oet speaking test you are blaming the oet organization you are blaming the entire oet instead of that one you can say i am slow the other way round let me speed up that's the name of the game that's it every success begins with transforming ourselves that is the key note of success that is the key note of success if you say conversation is was next time again you will say conversation next time again so what are you going to do for that it will not change ovd will not reduce its uh, uh, intensity or fluency that will be like that that's it now and a bit tricky and a bit tricky yes of course tricky so are you going to fall for it when you are walking on the road there may be some idiots who will just scare you by putting their hand forward or bringing your scoot their scooter in front or doing something we might have seen number of nuisance creators all our lives especially during the teenage people will be making funny things while going suddenly they will do something how do you react to that situation you will cry or you'll catch hold of that fellow and slap him so that is it there is nothing trick in that one whether you are able to overcome that trick yes actually you have come to the very door of heaven if you open the door if you ring knock the bell and open the door you will enter heaven but you are still not knocking the bell that is the problem conversations are fast you have come to the point but you have realized on the other side of the coin you have not seen your side of the coin so see your side of the coin if you realize that that means you have press the button and the door will open and you will cross that problem there is the most important vulnerable point vulnerable people will break out tricky if you can overcome that trick you are successful that means there is a trick you know that there is a trick something is tricky what is that thing which is tricky if you can realize then you can understand the trick i have already told you conversations are not fast we have to realize that we are slow. that is the trick that is the trick that just simple instead of seeing this side see this side and you will see your face your problem your difficulty your situation your condition so you will find all the strengths weaknesses opportunities and threats strengths i am strong in what i am weak in what you have identified your weak areas but instead of identifying your weak areas 
you are weak area you are blaming that the conversations are fast it is very tricky that means you are not able to overcome that trick you accept that one now turn the tables everyone hundreds thousands hundreds of thousands of people are writing the oet and they should realize this one okay i am going to be the torch bearer for making people understand that's okay for me now tricky to understand and follow yes if you understand the trick you can easily follow if you understand that trick you can definitely follow you cannot understand because you are a trick that you cannot follow because you cannot understand because it is a trick and that trick you have to open up you have to take pains to open up what is the trick what does the speaker want me to do here if you can identify we are going to see those things now i have difficulty in understanding their pronunciation their pronunciation their pronunciation what do you mean by their pronunciation do they have separate pronunciation and do you have separate pronunciation that means people can speak any way they want this is the third point i have difficulty in understanding their pronunciation that means what do you mean they have separate pronunciation and you have separate pronunciation it it shows that there are two types of pronunciation what do you mean to explain here that means english has no standard that means anyone can speak he can speak as he want and you can speak as you want try to understand the point here what i am telling you if you can that is the trick i am going to show you here if you can understand that trick then you are a master you can definitely understand the approach actually you don't know that english pronunciation is a standard you think that they have their pronunciation and you have your pronunciation and your pronunciation is right for you and their pronunciation is not right according to you maybe that is what it is that's why you are not able to understand because you think that your pronunciation is right and they are speaking in a different way and that's why you are not able to understand you don't know which is right which is wrong their pronunciation is right or your pronunciation is are there two different types of pronunciation the speaker's pronunciation and the listener's pronunciation that means you Vince Moll's pronunciation and the speaker's Abraham Lincoln's pronunciation are they two different? And his pronunciation is right or your pronunciation? Which pronunciation is right? Do you think? I said, do you think? 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 It is not think. Think. So now, this th th is not there in any other Indian languages. We have the th, but this th is not there in Indian language. This is a different sound totally. No Indian can speak this sound because it is not there in any Indian language. For example, ah, ah, this sound is different. Ah, man, wan, rat. Fan. This a is not there in any Indian language. That is why when they translate in language and write in some other language, they say "mian." The "a" will come in between. It is not "man." It is the beauty of English language, "man." But you cannot write in your mother tongue, Malayalam or Hindi or English. There is nothing sound like "a." A is there, I is there, A is not there. Then definitely it will be difficult for us to understand. A is there, I is there, who is there, but A. There is no sound in any Indian language. That's the difference. Okay. Like that, there are many sounds which are not there in our language and we cannot speak. For example, there is a word, women, women, women. What is this women? What is this women? Indians, we Indians, we speak. Even before I mastered English, I used to speak in the same way. Woman, 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 woman. But women, 
no english speaker will say woman woman is okay but women no is women plural is women that's the beauty if you don't understand it is your problem not their problem he is speaking it as uh, women and you are speaking it as women i show you the word now i'm going to pronunciation of this particular word you have given me a very good point wonderful point i appreciate pronunciation patterns is there any standard pronunciation patterns is there any standard or anyone can speak in any way they want is the point yes the word w o m a n w o m e n there are two words now now let us see the pronunciation patterns of these two words now this is singular and this is plural singular and plural now let us see what is the yes now i am taking you to the father of english that's cambridge dictionary so now let us see i don't know i'm not teaching you anything just showing you what it is now woman okay woman now this is u this is not letter u this is sound u this is sound u this is sound u okay this is a this is a sound a woman 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 so you have asked a wonderful question uh, bin simol i have got a chance to show you the difference woman 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 this is o and this is a woman woman you have a primary stress wo stress and others unstressed wo man wo stress wo man woman 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 your head will go forward woman so this is the way how you are pronouncing the word woman now let us see the other word plural now here the first one is not changing na but why the sound is changing here why the sound is changing here both their w o m a n o is wo and man but here it should be wo men but why it is not woman it is not wo it's we we min this is also e this is not o this is e and this is not a or a this is e same sound same sound we min we min we min we min stress here primary stress primary stress
women, 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 women. So these are called sounds. There is one full hundred marks paper for masters in English literature. We have hundred marks for this for phonetics. One full paper itself. Okay. Now try to understand this. E and E. Somebody has mentioned here, yeah, bless Joe's. It's not we men. Sorry. It's not we men. It's not men, it's men. Sound is there, you can see it very clearly here. It's E. It's E. Both are the same. Women. 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 That's it. Women. So if you don't know the right pronunciation, now, what do you think? I cannot understand the pronunciation means you have definitely come to the right point, um, been see more. You have come to the right point. You know the point. You have come to the gate of heaven. Here is the trick. Can you open the lid or not? What is the problem? You have to open the lid to know what is inside. You are saying, I'm not able to understand the pronunciation, but you do not know why. That is what I'm telling you why. And he said, women. He said, what is this? I did not understand. Why? Because I pronounce it as women or we men. So there is my problem. Whose problem? My problem. So learn the pronunciation. That's one option. And your friend is Cambridge Dictionary. So I have difficulty. I have difficulty. I appreciate. You know that you have difficulty. What is the difficulty you don't know? I have revealed you. Go to it. Cambridge Dictionary. For this small thing, no need to come to me. Cambridge Dictionary is the best source. I may sleep, but Cambridge Dictionary will not sleep. Listen, understand, and write up are difficult. So listening, understanding, and writing up are difficult at the same time. But if you, the conversations, if you can speed up yourself, if you want to catch a running bus, you should increase your, your speed should be more than the speed of the bus. <laughs> the success I'm telling you. if you can speak faster than the other person definitely you can understand this so try to overtake her. somebody enemy is running oh it is your enemy it is running run faster than the enemy then only you can catch the OET you are the police officer now OET is a thief suppose like that or a robber, you are going to catch him. Then what will you do? What will you do? You know the thief is running. You have to run faster than the thief. And that sort of training you need. That's why police training is outstanding. Military training is even more tougher. So military training only I am giving you. But many people cannot last. They fall down in the beginning and they raise their hands and run away. Military training is important. This is military training. Okay. Only those people can win battles for the country. Fight yourself first. Fight yourself first and strengthen yourself. Nobody is so strong as you. If you can win over you, yourself. If you cannot win over yourself, you cannot win over anything else in the world. That's the secret. From today onwards, increase your speed. How do you increase? Listen to the audio and repeat. Listen to the audio and repeat. Listen to the audio and repeat. Repeat after him. Repeat after him. How do you repeat? Take the audio, play the audio script, play the audio, take the audio script and try to read along with him so that you 
No problem if you are slow sometimes, fast sometimes, no problem. Read, read, read fast. If you are doing mistakes also, no problem, read. Increase your fluency. You know the thing, you have come to identify the secret. I already opened it, I opened the lid because you could not open it yourself. So I opened it. Now I have given you the remedy. This is called remedial teaching. Treatment, remedial treatment. Second thing, learn what is the trick he is playing. What is the trick? If there is a nail in front of you, remove the nail and throw it in the dustbin. Don't just go side and walk. That means you are only knowledgeable. You are not wisdom, person with wisdom. Okay. Change your attitude. Change your style. Third one. Understanding their problem. First one, conversations are fast. No, conversations are not fast. Conversations are natural. Natural. There is no his pronunciation, your pronunciation. There is nothing called fast or slow. Fluency is more important. Fluency is more important. So there is one standard. We follow that for that. Trick. What is the trick? Find out and follow it. Easy. Your question, your answer is there in your question. I have difficulty. So come up with solution. Understanding their pronunciation. So what is standard pronunciation? His pronunciation is different. I cannot understand. So problem is where? His pronunciation or my pronunciation? So you go and find out whose pronunciation is correct. What is the right pronunciation? Learn. You cannot understand. OET is not mad to give wrong pronunciation patterns. You think OET is crazy? They will select carefully with the experts and give it to you in front of you. They are providing it served on a plate. What you are paying 35,000 is nothing for what a service we are getting from there. The amount of research they do, you don't know. So, learn pronunciation. There is only one thing called right pronunciation. We call it as received pronunciation, RP. Many things I tell, maybe you don't know, but I don't mind. I will tell, received pronunciation. Now, what is this received pronunciation? Received pronunciation. So this is a standard. Very good. Thank you, Bin Simol. You have given me a platform, okay, to speak for almost 20 minutes. Received pronunciation. Now you should know, you go and research what is received pronunciation afterwards. Received pronunciation. This. Received pronunciation. Go to Cambridge Dictionary. It will tell you everything, whatever you want. Received pronunciation. Let it blow your mind. It is phonetics. Phonetics. It is specialized. Not everyone knows this one. Only experts will know it. And don't think I'm an expert, okay? I'm just an ordinary teacher. Okay, that's why I'm taking... Cambridge Dictionary, because Cambridge Dictionary is an expert, a very ordinary teacher. So only experts will know about this one. I too don't know much about this. Received pronunciation. I never ventured in that area. Also. Received pronunciation means the standard way in which middle class speakers of Southern British English pronounce word. A standard. Which is taken as a standard measure, perfect measure. So that is the right way that is put in Cambridge Dictionary and you have to follow that. You have to follow that. This is the reason what you have said, Vinci Moore, is the reason why many people fail in listening. 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 
Many people fail in listening. The standard way in which middle class speakers of Southern British English pronounce words, this is called received pronunciation. It's a part of phonetics, language of sounds. Now, what is phonetics? Phonetics is a language. Not everyone will know about this. Phonetics, it's very specialized, it's not ordinary. If you are extraordinary, then you will know this word itself. The study of the sounds made by the human voice in speech. How the sounds are made, that is called phonetics. So that is what I'm telling you now. How the words are spoken. There are many sounds we don't know that pronunciation also. We never in our lives we have made that pronunciation. Like, man. We don't know. We don't have in any other, uh, any other languages. There are 56 letters in regional languages or more than that. But no sound called ah. <laughs> Many sounds are there like that. Right. So learn the pronunciation patterns. You asked for me, I have given to you. It's not open just a criticism, it is constructive criticism. Constructive criticism, criticism is of two types. One is constructive criticism and the other one is a destructive criticism. And I'm not a, I'm not a people pleaser. I don't mind if people um, blame me or do anything. I don't mind. There are many people who say, uh, we are doctors, we don't have time. You are playing with the time of doctors. So why do you come to my platform? This is not right for you. Don't come. Did I request you or beg you to come? This is my style. Okay, I have to. What you want? You are very precious for me. So I give the best. I give my time. You are not giving me anything. I am giving my time. And this is not a paid session. This is a free session. I don't give it to anybody. I give giving with love. This is what brings the best out of me. So why should I sacrifice anything? Constructive criticism and destructive criticism. Destructive criticism will break you down. But constructive criticism will build you up. My style is building up because I love my students. And you don't know more than anything else because of online classes, I could not uh, stay at home. So in the house, it was difficult. So I came to Trivandrum and I took a big flat and I'm doing everything here. Yeah, I went last month and again, I'll go next month. Okay, that's different. Because this is my life. Yes. Yeah. So the first point is or not because it's no reason why we should not learn these things because nobody is helping that doesn't mean that it is not wrong it's not right right is always right what i have told you is everything the truth in front of you i did not say anything everything every dictionary is telling you that nah? what i am i'm just a mediator a mediator middle man middle man i'm bringing from the cambridge dictionary to you like how farmer is producing something and that originally I'm carrying it from there and giving it to you. I'm not doing anything extraordinary. There's nothing greatness in me. Everything, the greatness is of Cambridge Dictionary. And you are great because you are ready to listen for hours together on what nonsense topic, what others think. Okay. They don't have time for this. Precious matter. Even if you give millions, nobody will teach you these things. But they don't want to come. So I give freely. I, I have some uh, uh, 40 students. They're not ready to come and attend these sessions. They know every day I'll teach after six, any time I'll teach until 12 o'clock, two o'clock, four o'clock also. They don't want to come. So let them, let me give freely now to who is interested. Right, next. So this is the point. 
Now I'm giving the voice to Bincy Mall Thomas because this is her question. Yeah, Bincy Mall Thomas, it is your time. You have two minutes to speak. Was your question solved or not? What do you think about the points? And the stage is all yours. Good evening, sir. Yes, dear. Good evening. Sir, I'm very happy uh, that I understood where I am standing and how far I have to run. So uh, really, this is an eye-opening session for me. And um, I understood uh, how important it is to understand uh, the fluency and pronunciation. And I have to build up my own way to grab it. So yes. I'm so happy at least to you open my eyes. Thank you very much. So that is the first part. And then, right, let's move on. We'll go to one particular question. We'll finish that one. Right. So we'll go to one particular question. We are going to take the toughest zones. Toughest zones. So what are those toughest zones? Yeah. This is from E2 language question paper. Yes. Now look at the question. So we are going to study on this question pa uh, paper for uh, 10 minutes to 20 minutes. Because we are not finding the solution to this question, but we are going to find uh, measures to attack different types of questions. Yeah. Now what you can do is take your notebook, and I'm going to highlight some words. You have to write, take that word, okay? Make a systematic notes. And those who are not interested to make notes, just leave the platform. I don't mind, even if there are five students. And if you're on duty and you cannot do, okay, forgive it. Make notes and show that you are an awesome student for me. I take pride in such students. I don't take pride in people who give me money, 20,000, 30,000. I take pride in the students who really put their effort from the depth of their heart. Show that you deserve my attention. You deserve my appreciation. Prove that. And the stage is yours. Now, I am highlighting and underlining. This is number one, two, three. Okay, one, two, three, four. Okay. So, Bincy Mall, write number one and put what? Without capital letters. One dot WHAT. Just type in the chat box so that everyone will follow these things. Write them in your notes. Everyone. Number two, reason. Whatever I'm giving the numbers here, you can write there. So number one is what? Number two is reason. Number three is presentation. Number four is about. Find about. Write all of you. Write these words in your notebook. Okay. Because you are going to build your listening. You are going to get 450. Not less than that if you are doing this system. Number five. Not like this, Binzi. Number one, what? Number two, reason. Number three, presentation. Number one, dot, space, what? Number two, dot, space, reason. No capital letters. Number three, dot, presentation. Number four, dot, space, about. Like that I want. Number five, dot, space, select. Number six. Number seven. 
Number eight. Number nine. This is already taken, so no need. Already taken, this is repeated. That's why I'm giving red mark. That means this is very, very important. The word which is repeated is very, very important. The number of times it is repeated, the more the times it is repeated, the more important it is. Illustrate. Other colors, no need to write. Dangerous. So you have the number of words here. Yes, Vincent, that is what I want. Awesome. Number one. Number two. Number three, right. Number four, number five. You don't know what you are going to do today. You are a different learner now because you are Simon Sir's student. You are going according to rules and regulations. And nobody paid me for this particular session. And I will not take any fees for this session because this is my dream child. I want to give free this session to anybody and nobody can question me. My wish, number nine. Number 10. Number 11. Lindsay, you can mute your mic, please. Sure, sir. Thank you. So, 11 words are there, right? 11 words. Very good. Thank you, Lindsay. Now, what you have to do is, we got the words. We got the words. Very good. These are the 11 words Vinci has given. Now what we are going to do is, one question only we will study, but you don't know, don't go out of the room because I'm going to lock the room after some time and I will not allow anybody to come inside. My wish. Okay. So. Now, what you have to do is, this is uh, Jashan listening 15 test a week. Okay. Okay. Now, what I am going to do, you see me. Because next time I will not tell. Now only I am going to show you. This is 15B. So there, what I'm doing is, I'm copying these words. Okay. And I'm pasting them here. Right. Now what you are going to do is, okay. What you are going to do is, now here, whatever you type, take your notes and write what and leave the second line and third line. Two lines you leave. Yes. Now what you can do is you are making, this is very important thing that you are going to do now. So two lines below that. Because the same things, you need not worry about these words again, anything. Next time your word limit will be less. Now what? Okay. So here, 
What? What? What means what? Something, not someone. So what? It may be this, it may be that, it may be something, or it may be singular somethings, it may be these, it may be those. So it is called what? What? What are the alternatives for this one? What? It's not why. Now let us see what is the reason means why? What is the reason? Means why? Just simply. Why is the presentation about honeybees given? What is the reason? Means why? So you understand here, what is the reason? These two words have come together to become why. Why means what is the reason? So I have given you, I'm giving, I'm giving you the 12th word. I'm giving you the 12th word. Why? Okay. Why means what is the reason? Why? One word is equal to four words. Why? Why are you going to Trivandrum, Mr. Peter? Means what is the reason for your trip to Trivandrum, Mr. Peter? The same thing. Questions may be twisted. So what is the reason? Why I ask you what, what means? Something, something is the reason. This is the reason, that is the reason. These are the reasons, those are the reasons. What is the reason? Singular. So this and that, not these and those. So the reason is one. That's why he said, what is the reason? He did not say, what are the reasons? Try to read between the lines. Try to read between the lines. What is the reason? Not what are the reasons. The problem is within me if I don't understand this one. That means the answer is this or that, not these or those. Something, not some things. Something is the reason. In the place of what, if I put that one, that is right. Some things is the reason is wrong. Thing is the reason, things no. So because if I put that word, this is the reason. These is the reason wrong. Those is the reason wrong. This is the reason. That is the reason. So learn the style of unwrapping the trick. Vinci mold. You said something tricky. The question is something tricky. Half of the trick is revealed. It is not plural, it is singular. Not these, but it is this. Not those, but it is that. Not things, but it is thing. A thing. Not some things. Or not many things. Not several things. Not various things. Not two things, not three things. It's only one thing. That is one thing or something, not some things, something singular. Something is the reason, not some things are the reason. Don't be clueless. Don't see the question as a question. I have heard one Ravi Zacharias in his messages, he used to tell. Always question the questioner and you will find the answer to his question and attack him with that question. So in the question is more than 75% of the answer. So that is it. Now, yes, we action started. Some people are going, let them go. We'll close the box now. So number one, what? Come on, write down. Write down your synonyms, chat box. You have already written in your notebook, maybe. So write down. What are the synonyms of what? All of you, active. At least one word. Prove that you are not uh, the losers. You are the winners. The more words you write. Yes, the thing. 
this, that, not these, not those. Come on, write down whatever you want. You imagine, imagine. United we stand, divided we fall. Very good, Sangeeta, something. Rajya Lakshmi, that, very good. There is, this is, very good. Put any word there and it should fit. You are activating your brain. If you don't activate now in the exam, it will be very difficult for you. Those is wrong, Rubina. You cannot write those. Come on, write down as many as you can, fast. Peter is the reason. Doctor is the reason. Any name of a person. Okay. Then number two, you can continue, but write number one before and then you can write the words. Okay. So because I'm adding one by one, okay. You just write number one and give the options. Number two, reason. My words are capital letters. Your words will be small letters. Okay. Don't send any direct message. Don't send any direct message. So number two is the reason, reason. What are the other words for reason? Reason means because. Yeah, Binsi Mohl said cause, very good. Come on, write down. The same things will come in everything, okay? And uh, stay back until whenever it is possible, okay? Reason, cause, because. Reason, because, reason, why? Why means reason, okay? Why? Because of you too. On account of owing to. On account of owing to. What I am giving today is a very important session, you know. You don't know. And you will never know. Very, very important. Tomorrow morning you cry with happiness. Wow, leads to very good problem, very good. Three, presentation.
Pranita spelling mistake. Presentation. Demonstration. Explanation. Analysis. Whatever you want to think. Think about everything. Pranita rewrite the word with the, uh, explanation with correct spelling. We are going to do a marvelous work, okay? Just trust me. Pranita, again you wrote the spelling mistake. Again you wrote the spelling mistake. Yes, very good. Pranita, be careful. Huh? No problem. No problem. We we'll learn by mistakes. Showing, demonstrating, show, uh, um, explanation, demonstration, description, presentation, showing, analyze, analyzing, analysis, lecture. Okay. Anything it may be. A meeting, discussion, like that. The word may come there. Number four is about. About means, I'm giving some words. About, of, regarding, concerning, related to, with regard to. Whatever you get, you can write. Pertaining to. Yes, Nasra. Very good. Number five. Select. Select. So, select. Priority, choice, selection, most important one, option, choose, pick the best. Okay, whatever it is. Selection, other words, other words also the highlight, underline, bold, stress. That is selection. Yeah. And next number six. Number six. Number six is advise. Advise. Suggest. Recommend. Prescribe. Tell. Think about many other words. Whatever you want, you write. Everybody is right here. Inform. Encourage. Yeah. Related words. Bincy Mole. No need to say anything. Just to say yes after I tell you. What all these people are writing, make it to the groups, which group it makes. 
make a notebook take a notebook first page number 1 second page number 2 so third page number 3 fourth page number 4 like that make all these into one list you no need to write here anything what others are writing make a list of them and make a full page take one notebook one number number one page all the words related to it write them okay all the students are writing one one word it becomes full page no problem yes next one is seven seven means when when means at then then means at that time then means when means during that period synonym synonym synonyms when means point of time number 8 person person individual man woman boy girl lady gentleman these are all synonyms i don't whatever you get it your mind person 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 write whatever you get tomorrow you go and do the listening test you will see what yes doctor farid you can write the question no problem but we we'll discuss it next you can definitely write everything you are free to write anything no problem we are learning what is the second form here second form and third form are both the same or not you have to notice what is the second form of sting for example ring rang rang sting the stung the stung so what do you think here is it second form or is it third form so if both are there that means it may be second or it may be third so what exactly it is there that is right is a strong is passive voice so it is not second form you are mistaken it is third form used there you are thinking that it is second form it is not second form because second and third are both the same maybe so what are the forms of sting so let us check the forms of sting sting verb forms yeah what is the v2 v3 forms sting you can see v2 and v3 forms of the word sting are the same so it is s t u n g so yeah why third form is used it is passive voice passive voice you must use third form a person is stung by the honey bees honey bees 
sting people. Anip is a sting a person, sting present tense. But because it is passive, Anip is sting a person. Act directly. It is uh, first form. But passive voice definitely you have. any passive voice. What is the speciality? Is you have to use the third form. That's it. Yeah. Is that clear for you? Just respond in the answer box. Please. Yeah, that is passive voice. I have already told you. Just message it. We are moving forward. Next one is uh, number nine. Explain. Number nine is explain. So already the same words you will get. Yeah, explain. Sima Gupta. Check the spelling. Tomorrow you do listening, then you will know what it is the difference. Practice, practice, practice. Yeah, the reason is already done. So number 10 is illustrate. 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 Right. Next one, number 11, is dangerous. Dangerous. Dangerous, harmful, poisonous, difficult, problematic, harmful, risky, risky, hazardous, very good, bless. I don't know all of you, actively participate. I am the military commander, okay? You are my soldiers. Fight the battle. Fight the battle. Who says OET is difficult? OET is not difficult. You are difficult. You are not ready to fight for yourself. OET is difficult. Hmm? There are some crazy idiots. They say OET is making money. Who wants your money? It is blame game. Don't play the blame game on OET. OET is beyond your imagination, wildest imaginations. OET is beyond your wildest imaginations. They say, if you spit at the sky, the spitting will fall on your face. OET is the sky. You are on the ground. If you spit, it will reach the OET. So it is making money. I don't know how people make some foolish comments. Immature people. Very good. Risky. Toxicity. Yeah, write down whatever you are writing. Very good. Excellent. Outstanding. So now we have understood this one. Now what I will do is What I will do is, for this question, I'll put the audio, what audio is there. I'm going to type it for you now.
you will know what now the difference will we are playing by the oet way why i made you do these things you will know now johan uh, must one save the messages uh 15 and the pdf yes question number 1 yes 7 6 5 4 3 stop stop now we are seeing the other side of the question that is the audio script Yeah. Sure. I understand from your GP that you have arthritis. that's right yes it's in my hands and wrist mainly the finger joints in my hands get really puffed up when they are swollen like they are now the pain can get so bad that it stops me doing a lot of very simple things things like having a shower or getting dressed then there's the trouble i have making bright first and the thing where i have to grip and move my wrist like holding the kettle and pouring or buttering some toast well you get the idea it's not like i am an old woman i'm only 40 i see period tell me about your work period i used to be a head presser kama but i had to give it up after my hands started getting really bad period i couldn't just sit around the house and do nothing though kama So now I go to the local primary school where my kids are and have the children with the reading period and just lately I've started helping out a telephone helpline for people with difficulties period they have these special hands dash free forms that is a dash comma so it means i can do the work without needing to use my hands so much period it's only a volunteer position come on but i really feel like i'm doing something worthwhile
Is your mobility affected at all by the arthritis? Question mark. I do have trouble getting in and out of bed, comma, or out of bath, period. I also need help getting out of a chair if it's a bit low, period. I move around the house with the walking aid I have, comma, and when I go out, I tend to use a wheelchair, period. Our car has also been modified, so at least I'm independent. I can go to the shops or out with friends, period. I'm guessing you have had a physio treatment before. Period. New line. Yes. Period, in the past, it's mainly consisted of heat treatment, comma, but now I'm really interested in some sort of gentle exercises, if that's at all possible, period. I also really want to make sure that my hands splints are still helping and not making the condition worse, period. Sure, comma, I can look at that for you, period, new line. I've also been to an occupational therapist before, period. I needed help when things started getting really difficult around the house, period. I found her very helpful. She had lots of gadgets to help me to do things like dressing and cooking, come on. without making the pain worse. Period. Okay. Period. We can talk more about some of the techniques you use to help you at our next appointment. Period. What about your medication? Question mark. New line. I take analgesics for the pain mainly these days, period. I used to take those, you know, those anti-inflammatory drugs, comma, but the benefits seemed to wear off and they started making me feel sick. So I had to stop taking them, period. I do sometimes get a steroid injection, comma, but not very often, period. It works really well at reducing the pain for a few weeks, but it hurts like hell, period. Dr. Wong has mentioned a steroid tablet I could take 
which will work in a similar way, comma, so we might be looking onto that soon, period. And, comma, or, comma, a couple of times a day, I have an analgesic cream that I rub into my hands, period. I don't know if it really works very well, though. Now, what I'm going to show you is, here are some words. They're not proper, not typed properly, but you know what are the words. Okay? If anything is there, I will set that word right. No problem. Okay. Now, you can see there are some words. There are some words. Trouble. This is one word. Okay? Trouble. Sorry. Trouble is one word. Trouble is one word. What do you mean by this? What do you mean by this? Try to understand what I'm telling you. Okay. Grip. What do you mean by this word grip? What do you mean by this word grip? Okay. Grip means hold. Try to understand. Now I'm going to give you some options. I'm going to give you some options. Now I'm going to give you a separate set of it. Trouble. See the word trouble. See the word trouble. 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 Consisted of means what? Can anyone give a different setting consisted of? The food mainly consisted of. Can you give the synonym for this word consisted of? Consisted of. Anybody? Yes, come on. More words, made up of, involved, included, containing. Come on, give your own words. Start learning, start learning, start learning, stop acting and start learning. Made of, very good, new word, Rubina, excellent. Included, I-N, Nasra, you type the E-N, I-N. So this is how we start learning. I'm really interested. I'm really excited. I'm really motivated. Okay. So words come like that. Okay. Very good. So I have given you how you can include, how you can improve your pronunciation. You want to, how many of you want to improve your pronunciation? Tell me. I'm going to show that one to you, how to pronounce properly. Because there are a lot of artificial intelligence, okay, which will help you to improve your pronunciation, fluency. How many of you want to improve? Write your name there. Write your name there. I already gave, demonstrated how to improve your pronunciation. Write your name there. I'm going to show you. Ten minutes, five minutes every day in the morning, five minutes every day in the afternoon, five minutes every day in the evening will make you a master in pronunciation. If you want to write your name, write your name. I told many times, write two names, first name and second name, because sometimes there have been many people, I have many students, I cannot, Vinci Mall, many Vinci Malls are there. Many Vinci's are there, many Sima's are there. Okay, so, Lara Ibadil is only one, okay, that is a peculiar name. Okay, Anvi is also a peculiar, so one name, I can understand. But if, say, Jacob, I cannot understand. Better give your two names. 
And when you type your name, type with capital letters, Sangeeta, S capital letter, P capital letter. Don't you know I'm not telling you? Why are you not responding? You should go into your brains and your blood and your brains. Write with capital letters. Raji, R capital letter. Why did you not write S capital letter for Samuel? It should be in your blood. Whatever I am telling you, it should be injected straight into your blood and it should pump through the heart. When you are writing your name, you don't respect your name. Don't you want to keep capital letter to your name? You should be fully aware of what you are doing. You are fighting a battle and you don't know from where the arrow is coming. I am the enemy. I am the OET. I am teaching you. Like how I am behaving like an OET and teaching you and setting you right. And I will attack you from anywhere. It may be spelling, it may be pronunciation, it may be word, it may be capital letter, punctuation, one letter, two letter, anything else. I will be setting you right. I should see minimum number of mistakes. If I take your name, that means you are wrong. That means I have shot a bullet at you and you are dropping down dead. One bullet is enough to lose your 10 marks in the OET. Don't you know that? You are paying the price of 35,000 and you are paying the price of your life and death there. Learn, play it by the rules. Don't manipulate things according to your suitability, carelessness and recklessness and irresponsibility. Tomorrow, because of you, the world should know about who is Simon Peter. I'm not joking. What you have to do is now like this. Very good. I've got a number of names. So do it. No need to prove me. Prove it to yourself. Take any artificial intelligence. This is a paid version. You cannot do all these things. But you have a lot of free versions. On the phone. On the mobile. You have a double mic. Where when you speak, it is called speech to text. Or download a mobile application called speech to text. Call your friends. Why do you want to be selfish? You don't have even one loud person in the world. I love you people, so I'm giving you so much. You can't call one person and give this one free. I'm giving you free. Go and give somebody free. Nah? Because of your selfishness, this group is not growing. Be generous. I'm generous. People say, Simon sir is teaching too much. Simon sir is not teaching too much. You want too less. You are, you are, you have only small packet, small. I want a mug of tea, not a cup of tea. So I take a mug. How much you want? That much only you will take. That means you are, your portion, your fill, your capacity is very low. Simon sir is very generous. Take a big tank and fill it. Open your brain, it will feel hard by itself. God has blessed you with a wonderful brain. So take speech to text. Download. There are a number of applications called speech to text. This I should tell you. You are using 50,000, 40,000, 1 lakh mobiles in your hands and playing the fool with your mobiles. Why don't you explore? That is called childishness. Ignorance is bliss. I don't know. So it's okay for me. What okay? The world is going forward and you are sleeping still. Many people are passing and you are still lazy in yourself. Speech to text. Sleep. Sleep. You are not in sleep. You are in slumber. What is the difference between sleep and slumber? Sometimes I say, I slumbered. Means even if the elephants are trample, I will not wake up. That much is depth of my sleep. You are in that deep sleep. Sleep has different levels. First level, you will just uh, uh, turn this side, turn that side, turn that side, turn this side. You don't get sleep. Second level, you went to sleep. 
and some small sound comes, you wake up. You get distracted. There's a second level of speed, sleep. So speech to text. Say Android, if it is Android. Or say, if it is Apple, I don't know. iOS for Apple. Speech to text, Android app. Download that one. Which is the best one you see? Best Android dictation apps for easy speech to text. Download. You want to speak like Simon Peter? Do it. Who stopped you? You are the culprit. You are the reason. You are pulling yourself back. You know, bullock cart, we say bullock cart. What happens? The bulls, the bulls, bullock cart, the bulls are running, running, running. After some time, they'll, they'll get tired. Then uh, the person, the rider of the bullock cart will poke at, on the back. Just one poke, and they will run again with double speed. You need Simon Peter to poke you? Go, dance. Nobody will stop you. You are the person who is stopping you. Is there a speech to text app for Android? Yes. Live transcribe. Okay. No, we don't want transcribe. Speech to text. Speech to text. This can type in any language you want. 70 languages it seems. We don't want 70 languages. We want only English language. Don't use this one to learn your Malayalam or Hindi or Punjabi. Try to use it for English. Download it. If it, you have an Apple iPhone. iOS. iOS. Just download it. Go there. iOS, Apple iPhone. Yes, on iPhone, Android and iPhone. Best speech to text apps for Android. You see, try to download two or three and try to take the best one. Do research. Evernote is wonderful. I used it five years back. It's paid version also free. Five, no, not five. Ten years back, I used Evernote. But now I stopped using because I have a paid version of Microsoft and also paid version of Google. So they will do for me. So you take these things easy, very nice applications. And then what you do is take a script in front of you, keep it in front of you. Keep the script in front of you. And dance the tide. It's a dance the time. It's a dance the time. That means my pronunciation is wrong. I could not give the exact pronunciation for that one. They're a mistake. So what I'll do, it did not type time. It typed. So what I'll do, I'll learn the pronunciation. Time. Tide. Now I got it. But my pronunciation was not right. That's why artificial in, uh, intelligence. This is the generation AI generation. What do you mean by AI? Artificial intelligence. It has taken the internet by storm. Use it. People with no caliber in anything, people who want to reach the world, they are flaunting internet and artificial intelligence. And they are minting millions. You can't learn English. A poor individual who doesn't know anything, he only has some bike riding skills. He shows those bike riding skills on the internet and thousands of bike riders are watching those things and he's making millions. 
You can't learn English with these things. I told you, invite one friend to this. If you had passed on, if you are only one person, maybe that one person, if you pass on to three people, at least three people, two people will see and one person will come. So try how to, how to make others do what you want. You want something, you have to get it done. That's it. Okay. So pass out the information so that they can come and see the demonstration classes. And they will appreciate you. They'll thank you. Take a paper into your hands. Every word you speak, it should be typed there. If it is not typed properly, that means it is your mistake. So rectify your mistake. Every one of you, your pronunciation should be absolutely excellent, not rubbish nonsense. I'm showing you, demonstrating you. Do that on your own. Text two, colon. Colon. My pronunciation was wrong. I'm demonstrating you how to pronounce it. First time it type the colon. Second time it typed it properly and said it right. You want pronunciation? You want to follow the pronunciation of the OET? Do it. Dance the tide. When the tide comes, people will say, oh, save me, save me. You dance the tide. Because you are an expert in swimming. One, you take one text, text part C. Don't take part A, take part C, any one text. Keep it in front of you. And don't bother about anything in the world. Operation forward march. Nothing less and nothing more. No playing the fool. Stop blaming. Stop giving lame excuses. Excuses are the food of fools. Not to the wise and individuals. Prenatal origins of heart disease. New line. Heart disease is the greatest killer in the developed world to die, comma, currently accounting for 30% of all deaths in Australia, period. 
a concept which is familiar to us all is that traditional risk factors such as smoking, comma, obesity, comma, and genetic makeup increase the risk of heart disease, period. However, comma, it is now becoming apparent that another factor is at play. A developmental programming that is predetermined before birth, comma, not only by our genes, but also by their interaction with the quality of our prenatal environment. Period. New line. Pregnancies that are complicated by suboptimal conditions in the womb, comma, such as happens during preeclampsia or placental insufficiency, comma, enforce physiological adaptations in the unborn child and placenta, period. While these adaptations are necessary to maintain viable pregnancy and sustain life before birth, comma, they come at a cost, period. The biological trade-off is reduced growth, comma, which may in turn affect the development of key organs and systems such as the heart and circulation, comma, thereby increasing the risk of cardiovascular disease in adult life, period. Overwhelming evidence is in more than a dozen countries has linked to development under adverse intrauterine conditions, leading to low birth weight with increased rates in adulthood of coronary heart disease and its major risk factors. Hypertension, comma, atherosclerosis and diabetes. Period, new line. New line. The idea that a fetus susceptibility to disease in later life could be proved up by the conditions in the womb has been taken up vigorously by the international research community, comma, with considerable efforts concentrating on nutrient supply across the placenta as a risk factor. Period. But that is just part of the story, Colin. How much oxygen is available to the fetus is also a determinant of growth and of the risk of adult disease, period. Dr. Dino Gersani's research group at Cambridge University in the UK is asking what effect reduced oxygen has on fetal development by studying populations at high altitude. Period. New line. Gersani's team studied birth weight records from healthy tea term pregnancies in two Bolivian cities at obstetric hospitals and clinics selectively attended by women from either high income or low income backgrounds, period. Bolivia lies at the heart of South America, comma, split by the Andean Cordillera into areas of very high altitude to the west and areas at sea level to the east as the country extends into the Amazon basin, period, at 400 meters and almost 4,000 4, meters above sea level, comma, respectively. The Bolivian cities of Santa Cruz and La Paz are striking examples of this difference, period. 
pregnancies at high altitude are subjected to a lower partial pressure of oxygen in the atmosphere compared with those at sea level, period. So women living at high altitude in La Paz are more likely to give birth to underweight babies than women living in Santa Cruz, period. But is this a result of reduced oxygen in the womb or poorer nutritional status? Question mark. New life. What Gusani found was that the high altitude babies showed a pronounced reduction in birth weight compared with low altitude babies. Even in cases of high maternal nutritional status, period. Babies born to low income mothers at sea level also showed a reduction in birth weight, comma, but the effect of undernutrition was not as pronounced as the effect of high altitude on birth weight. Semicolon. Clearly, comma, fetal oxygenation was a more important determinant of fetal growth within these communities, period. Remarkably, comma, although one might assume that babies born to mothers of low socioeconomic status at high altitude would show the greatest reduction in birth weight. Come on. These babies were actually heavier than babies born to high income mothers at high altitude, period. It turns out that the difference less lies in ancestry. New line. The lower social income, the lower, the lower socioeconomic groups of La Paz are almost entirely made up of Aymara Indians, Kama, an ancient ethnic group with a history in the Bolivian highlight spanning a couple of millennia. Period. On the other hand, individuals of higher socioeconomic status represent a largely European and North American admixture, comma, relative newcomers to high altitude, period. It seems therefore that an ancestry linked to prolonged high altitude residence confers protection against reduced atmospheric oxygen, period. New life. The Sani's group also discovered that they can replicate the findings observed in Andean pregnancies in hen eggs. Colon. Fertilized eggs from Bolivian birds native to sea level show growth restriction when incubated at high altitude, comma, whereas X from birds that are native to high altitude show a smaller growth restriction, period. Moving fertilized X from hence native to high altitude down to sea level not only restored the growth comma but the embryos were actually larger than sea level embryos incubated at sea level period the researchers could thereby demonstrate something that only generations of migration in human populations would reveal period What's more, come on, 
When looking for early markers of cardiovascular disease, Kama, the researchers discovered that growth restriction at high altitudes was indeed linked with cardiovascular defects. Shown by an increase in the thickness of the walls of the chick heart and iota. Period. This all suggests the possibility of halting the development of heart disease at its very origin, comma, bringing preventing medicine back into the womb. How much time will it take? <laughs> Now, when you are doing like this, you will bother about the flu and say right or wrong, don't matter, no matter what, whatever, just go on, go on, go on, go on. Afterwards, when you see many words are typed, you feel, you know, oh, this many words I typed correctly, that means my pronunciation is improving, okay. My pronunciation is improving. Initially, you start fluency, low fluency, not very high fluency, not less fluent, low fluency. You can speak slowly like this. Heart disease is the greatest killer in the developed world today. Period. Fluency is meant. Now, what is fluency? Fluency is not speed. Fluency is not speed. Fluency is the rate of the flow of words. Rate of a flow of are the words going like that, like a thread or a garden, garden, flowers in the garden? The thread is running through, that is called fluency, is the thread in the garden of flowers. That is the words. Words are flowers, and you are making a garland and you are adding flowers to the thread. That is called fluency. Fluency is the thread. Okay. And sentence is becoming, that is the garland. And flowers are the words. Try to understand the relationship. You are adding words with fluency to make a sentence. You are, you are adding flowers to the thread to make a garland. That is the difference. So improve your fluency. Slow and steady. Directly, first day, don't try to do like Simon said. Okay. Do do as you do. Slowly. Heart disease is the greatest killer in the developed world today. This is not fluency. This is also fluency. Word by word, but don't say like this. Heart disease is the greatest killer in the developed world today. I pronounced it word only, not world. So that's why it type of word. word. 
Even if Peter self speaks wrongly, it will type wrong only. So try to understand that. If you can't speak fast, speak word by word like this. In the initial first day, do like this. There is no problem. So today you can think about other things. Heart disease is the greatest killer in the developed world today. Currently accounting for 30% of all deaths in Australia. Not like this. Beginning. Make it a humble beginning. Don't be a proud Rory. Right. This is how you have to do. Today I have taught you about how to improve your pronunciation. How to practice, how to catch the words, learn. Day by day, you will be increasing your pronunciation. Just to do it like this every day, morning five minutes, afternoon five minutes, evening five minutes. Make use of your mobile phones. Flaunt the power of your mobile phone for your own benefit. Why are you using great mobile phone to show off to others? At least make use of it properly. And many things which will help you. Okay. Now let us see here. So, there we are. Now, and with Jacob, you said you are preparing for all the four skills. Very good. And with Jacob, unmute. One second. Yeah. Now unmute, Anvi. All of you give a frank opinion. If it is a rubbish, also you tell me, sir, this is rubbish. Okay. But be genuine. Keep your hand on your heart and speak the truth. It needs courage to speak the truth. All of you. Okay. Tell me, openly tell it is rubbish, no problem. I don't mind because I know whether it is rubbish or not. Last time in my class, I told you, if somebody says, Mr. Simon, you are an idiot. Okay, thank you. You have told me something new which I don't know. I will not get angry with other person who is telling Mr. Simon, you are an idiot. Why should I get mad at that person? A mature person. I will not go and fight with him. If I fight with him, I will be a real idiot. Don't I know whether I am an idiot or not? So, don't mind. Tell frankly, whatever you want. Openly tell. But just put your hand to your heart and analyze what type of benefit it gave you or how much loss it gave you this particular session. Okay? You have to speak. Yeah, Anvi Jacob, it is your turn now. Synonyms that can be identified from question and uh, question as well as options as useful. Yeah, you can speak thirty seconds to one minute, no problem. Once you finish your speech or our words, you can say pass. Okay. Next, Faiga. Faiga. Hello. Hi, sir. How are you? I'm fine, Faiga. How are you? Good news to Sudan. Thank you. I'm fine, thanks. Uh, sorry, yes. uh, sorry, sir. I came late. I uh, I don't know what this lecture talking about, but I I will try. I, I will try to attend it for this one. This one. This one means which one? YouTube. YouTube. I, ah, yes, I, I YouTube. Be specific. Be specific. Okay. Be specific. Yeah. Okay. Learn to be specific. Thank you. That will only improve. Okay. Yeah. This thank you. 
Thank you for your effort with us. Sir. Which one? Yeah. This one, it is miscommunication. No, no. Yes, yes, yes. Talk Through to YouTube. Your... YouTube, yes. Thank uh, you, sir. Bye. You say YouTube, others will understand. If you say this one, what is this? This one? Is it yes. Zoom? Yes. Or is it yes. software? Or is it yeah. Zoom? Or is it a computer? Or is it phone? No. What is this? Yeah. This one, everyone will be surprised. So you have to be yeah. very clear. That's the point. Okay. okay. Yeah, you are right. Thank you for your right. effort. Thank you. Next, uh, bless Joe. Be ready. Vinci Mall Thomas. Uh, sir, uh, session was very effective. And uh, how to use this um, application, I do not know. I will try from tomorrow. Um, but uh, session was really good. And many things I have learned from this session. So I understood how important it is to learn uh, synonyms and uh, speak fluently and pronounce properly. And um, use a good sentence and understand uh, the conversation properly. Uh, this is very important in listening. Mm. So um, all of the class is very effective and uh, uh, this is a very good session, sir. Yes. Thank you. Okay, fine, fine, fine. So next one is uh, Bless Joes. Uh, hello, sir. Good evening. Good evening. Once you finish your speech, you can mute back all of you. Once you finish speaking, you finished, then you can mute. That's the order will go. Because every time I cannot mute, unmute, mute, unmute like that. You can do follow the system. That is the called protocol. Protocol means system. Okay. Uh, yeah. Bless. Next to Catherine, really sorry, Constance will be ready next. Yeah, bless. So, okay, sorry, carry on. Uh, no issues. The so class was really informative. I mean, uh, the way you taught and the pronunciation, especially the phonetics background you are keeping it with, it's it's really plausible because uh, when uh, I mean, I think in India, uh, the most problem in our uh, like our education and all that, it's not criticism. It's it's just that. Uh, whenever we read or anything, I mean, I if I take my own that I used to read when I was a kid, so I used to read it without any, uh, without looking into any comma or any full stop. I used to read like that. But uh, when we came to know the usage of comma, where we use the pauses, where we have to exactly how to do the pauses and the way they speak, and of course, uh, the way you actually taught us today, I mean, really plausible. I mean. Uh, these, I mean, it's very actually effective in speaking, which I am not doing. So. Uh, this is as a wonderful, wonderful class from from my end, sir, which I have actually so far. I think I was looking for, and especially the synonyms part. I'm um, listening also uh, when we are struggling for the options, which you said that how to choose the answers and all that. So that was really effective, sir. Thank you so yeah. much for your session. Yeah, thank you very much. Next one, Constant Mafuza. Uh, good evening, sir. Uh, this was a very info informative uh, class. Um, actually, I didn't know about this app. So this was a really eye opener to me. So I'll start using it. And it actually teaches you how to punctuate, which is a, a problem. To one of uh, to one of us, especially when you are writing um, a letter. Thank you so much for the lesson. We are, I'm learning a lot. Very good, very good. So we are going to close the session after this discussion. Then afterwards, we are going for the second round where we will find out all the synonyms, how it is they are used. So how many of you are interested? Okay, they can send me a personal message. I am interested in the second session. So I will send them the link because that is purely class only for the registered students, regular students. I'm sending that link. So whoever is interested, you send me a message. So if you are registered, then I'll send you the link and I'll give you because we are going to focus. We are not going to take it lightly. So we are going to focus on it very seriously. So, um, so with the limited participation, We'll go through that one. Even if there are five students only, no problem for me. But registered students and serious students message me and I'm going to take that session. Right. Then next one. Uh, yeah, we are going to start a new batch. 
uh, the coming week, first it will be a December batch. It is Christmas batch. Christmas batch is a festival for us. So I'm going to open a special batch. Uh, last week of December, uh, from Christmas to New Year, uh, we'll have holidays, but I will be working from wherever I am. I'll be in a, some picnic and some other place, but still the class will be going on. That's a different thing. So uh, Christmas batch is going to be very special. And uh, that's really, there's some special uh, features there that I will discuss later because I did not finalize regarding the fees because we are going to increase the fees for these classes from January 1st. So that only serious students will come and join with us because I'm fed up with the students who are not attending regularly. So instead of 10 students paying normal fees, I'll take eight students only increase the fees that, that I've got. So why should I teach those students simply taking the money and not they're not attending like that? So fees is going to increase. So before that one, Christmas blessing is there. So if anybody is interested, new students, you can contact me for the next year. This batch is full now, already filled up. No admissions now. Next batch, if you are interested, any new students, you can contact me personally. Uh, then next one is... Um, yeah, Constance, sir. Uh, Constance, Mafosa, can you tell from which place of the world are you? And uh, um, you are a newcomer to our classes. And how did you learn this? What benefits you got? I want to share. Because you are from the Middle East and beyond that. Right? Can you share your experience, please? Uh, okay, good evening. Um, when I uh, I started these lessons, I saw the link on, was it on Facebook? And then I joined, it was on Telegram and then I joined. I had challenges in listening, especially part B. Uh, um, and then Simon uh, taught me how to tackle part B. And nowadays I'm using that trick at most, the least I can get is five over six. It's five over six. But now I'm still struggling with A and, and C. But B, I think I'm, I'm fine. Even in, re, in reading, the part B, it, he taught me well. At least I get four out of six or five out of six. And the other day, we were doing a synonyms, which was very good so that you, you can tackle part B without even um, going into the text. You just read the question and you read the answers and you, you figure out basing on the questions and the synonyms, which is so important, I think, in, in English, um, in OET. We really need to know the synonyms and it's going to be easy for us. Yeah, for reading, I'm still struggling with A and C, where I, I really need to get the trick and the gist of the of the tips. This is why I'm always following him. If he puts a Zoom meeting, I'm quick to to join the class. Yes, uh, Constance, you have a blessing because I have seen you. You are a regular student. You did not join our classes. But you have given a wonderful testimony. And mm -hmm. I have been seeing you regularly on the platform. Whenever I give you a link, you are there. Am I right? Yes. Yes, yes, it's true. It's Sometimes true. Sometimes even when you are on duty, you told I am on duty, but I cannot yes. respond, but you are attending. Yes or no? Yes, it's true, sir. There is a blessing for you. I'm going to add you in a new group. Which yes, country sir. are you from? I'm in Namibia. 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 So yes. you are the torch bearer for Namiri, Namibia group. Pardon? You are the torch bearer for Namibia group. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. I'm the one who I'm sent going to start a new, um, new group for Namibia. I started a group for Pakistan. I started a group for Zimbabwe. Many people like that one. So because they were interested, I started. And uh, the groups are going on, growing now. So yes. I will start a group with you there and I'll make you admin. You add, make a list of all your friends, save them in your phones, and add them into the group. At least 
how many you can send? How many? I'm going to give you a free admission for you. This is my first Christmas gift. Oh, thank you so much. So your responsibility to this is you are not paying me by even a single rupee, but you are paying me by your dedication to your group. Make your group the best in Namibia, okay? Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. Because tomorrow is 25th. And now yes. within another one and a half hour, we are going to start our Christmas, uh, new 25th date. So next month, mm. 25th is our Christmas. So this is my blessing, the first blessing in this year. Okay? Yes, sir. So do the best, Thank try you. to add as many students as that to the group. So if some of them will get benefited, so you will be blessed, okay? Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. That is the only payment I'm asking you to do. Okay, sir. And you are given a free pass, wild card, entry. You can Thank add you. as many friends and make them, motivate them and ask one will add 10 like that, but encourage them to do. I'm doing this benefit. You do add some more friends like that. Ask them your numbers and do it, whatever you want. But that is the only thing I want from you. That is your fees for me, okay? Okay, sir. And done. Okay. All right. Thank you, sir. Yes, welcome. And next, uh, Nasra. Nasra Muhammad. Yes. Hello, Nasra. Hello, How good evening. You? Alhamdulillah, I'm fine. I'm fine. Yes. Thanks, sir. Alhamdulillah. What are fine. you thinking, sir? I came to learn OET. What you are teaching, typing, correct, no? No, it is like, uh, you know, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm getting, I'm understanding now. Uh, it's like uh, daily knowledge that I'm gaining and it's like building blocks for the for the exam, you know, for the preparation wow, of the exam. Wow, wonderful so, phrase you have used, building blocks. Yeah. Yes. So, ahead. like, I am feeling like um, I'm gaining the, uh, you know, the uh, specific knowledge for the for the for the preparation of the exam and and each area how how to get you know uh, the answers and how 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 I can. Uh, my my biggest struggle now is is managing with the time but i feel like it's the beginning it's expected so like uh, i'm i'm trying like uh, to overcome with the difficulties i'm getting and i'm i'm getting daily like really yesterday i benefit fr from the you know how to get the get answers from the from the headings so I was like practicing that. It was really beneficial and really, and I appreciate it. And I appreciate everything that's yeah. here. But, but really, and it's like daily knowledge that I'm getting, you know, every day I'm getting something new to overcome with some difficulty I'm facing. So it's like, I'm feeling like which daily, if, we, if, I, if I maintain going with this schedule, I will be going to the destination that I'm going to. So, yeah, sometimes yes. I'm shouting. Maybe you'll get angry with me. Why is Sari shouting like this? And no, no, it's uh, shouting. Yeah. <laughs> this is motivational speak. We call it. So we will be more encouraged more, and, and we will be trying our best to do. You know, this is our for our interest. So I, I, I'm, I'm getting where you are going. Yes, very good. Yes, very good. yes, yes. So from the next session. I'm going to select the five students and I'm yeah. going to research in the speaking. Yeah, you can uh, mute the phone. Next is a Dr. Farid. Be ready, Dr. Farid. Next is your turn. Be ready. Next is your be ready. Because I don't know what time, when I bless and what time I do, I don't know. Be ready, everyone. Okay. So next time, Dr. Farid, it is your turn. So Dr. Farid is a very clever person. He joined with me. So he paid 25,000, okay? But he was in very difficulty those days because of the heavy stress of work and he could not. So he said, I will join, sir, but my time is very tough. So let me uh, learn a little later. And he's coming and he's very talented. He will scrutinize it with microscopic eyes. You have seen a wonderful question he asked. Why is it is a past tense tongue? Is it so, so such wonderful questions he will pose? And he's really very talented. Uh, he can, if I give him mic, he can speak even 5, 10, 15 minutes also. 
or without any uh, pass because he has that knowledge. But still, I will give you my. But uh, I want to give you a hint before the maximum time for you is three minutes. Okay, the time starts now. The stage is all yours, Mr. Farid. Are you there? Are you at work? Dr. Fari, the last call. Are you there? Okay, maybe he's busy or something. Uh, next one. Pranita. Pranita. Hi, sir. Good evening. Yeah, Pranita, I have seen you attending regularly. I have Hi, seen sir. you attending regularly. So I'm going to bless you today. I have Thank seen you. you regularly, give your feedback regarding the sessions. I'm definitely blessing you. But in what way, I don't know. I'm thinking in the meanwhile, how to bless you. Okay. So, I am blessing you, sir. Why? Because when I was praying, I lost to God. <laughs> I want to choose. I don't know anything about it. I know my weak points. I am very low in grammar and uh, uh, pronunciation. All I am weak only. But when I will start it to learn your classes, I am very much confident and uh, um, I will improve myself, sir. So that's what. It's not right time to um, uh, tell to you, but uh, I am very blessed you, sir. Sorry, sir. I am telling to you about you more, but uh, uh, my my baby is crying, sir. So sorry. Okay, no Thank problem. You, no problem. Carry on. Carry on. Okay. Mm -hmm. So fine. I'll tell you afterwards. Okay. The next one is Raji Mary Sanger. This girl uh, is good there. evening. The beginning of the session, I have yes. seen. I think first person to come in this session is Raji Mary Samuel. Somewhere one to three persons she yes. is there. Am I correct, Raji Mary Samuel? Three names you came there. Yes. Yes, sir, yes sir. You are sitting like that blue book. Come to your seat and not moving anywhere, or you went in between and came back. Tell the truth. No, no, no. I am sitting all the <laughs> your sections. Oh, my <laughs> goodness, sweet little girl. Okay, tell me. What did sir, you learn today? This is my first class. I did not attend any listening class from OEG. I don't know anything about the OEG. But this is very effective session. Actually, really, I am so blessed with your section also. I am listening from your uh, uh, pronunciation and synonyms also. Really, very effective section. Actually, I, I am beginner only. I don't know anything about the OEG. This is my first class I attended. <laughs> Okay, fine. That's very good. That's very good. Right. So, what made you stick on to continue for the lecture for so long? Lecture, maybe this is the longest lecture in your lifetime, right? <laughs> really, it's a long lecture because we came from the duty. Actually, I am working in Saudi Arabia. I came from duty directly. Uh, switch on my mobile. I attend your uh, sections. <laughs> really okay. but it's, it was very effective really really it is it was it was very effective you're yeah, very good very good fine that's really fine you message me personally and you're going to get my blessing okay okay thank you very much sir sir thank you very much right and next one is rubin rubin of cg 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 g cg CG hello, good evening, sir. Yeah, hello, CG. Uh, sir, uh, yesterday I cannot attend the whole uh, session, so I attended today all the session. I am on duty now. That's why I cannot uh, uh, answer any questions you are asking. This uh, session is very nice, and uh, I have some idea about synonyms um, and uh, the words we can use other than the, I got some idea today because right. every time whenever they are saying synonyms, I don't know what is that. Yeah, fine. Very good. Very good. Uh, Thank you very next, much. Yes. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Pujas Binu. Hello. Yeah, Ushas. Yeah. Hello. Good evening, sir. Good evening. Hello. Okay, um, this class is very helpful for me. Then uh, 
now i started to write one synonyms synonym diary also i prepared actually i don't wow know that, that is i so, encourage that's excellent wonderful actually actually before some friends told me to prepare one diary but uh, never i not uh, started to write uh, i am lazy to write and um, um, actually i now i realize how to identify for the reading i am very poor to identify for the reading so now i realize this all synonyms only my problem to identify the uh, answer so i like to uh, continue for this classes and uh, i want to learn more from your side Very good. Very good. Are you the one okay. who was recommended by that girl? What is her name? Upula. Really? Uh, no, no, sir. No, sir. Saudi Arabia. No, no. I'm from Kuwait. Okay, you are from Kuwait. There is another Shiji also. So you are Shiji, and she is Shiji. Uh, confusion. Uh, uh, no, uh, okay. my name is Ushas. Ushas. Oh, your name is Ushas. Okay, fine. Yeah. Fine. Yes. Okay, yes. you are from Kuwait. Okay. Yes, I'm right. from Kuwait. Okay. Yeah. So yeah, are you very, getting are you getting the worth of what you paid? Uh, yes, yes, of course. Really, I got. Or do you it. think that yes, I'm I, wasting I, time? I, I, no, no, no. The subject I'm teaching something else. How you thinking like that? actually i don't know about this class how, how it is going this is second class for me then only now only i knows what is going inside the class what all things we need to learn and um, how to learn it and um, uh, different kind of things is there to uh, read it the first then only we have to start this oet material then i realized from your side yeah, this is very helpful sir right Okay. Next. Why O V two one four one? Thank you. Why O V two one four one? Okay. Fine. So that's the end of the session. So regular students, Farid, Doctor Farid, are you there? Did you come back? Okay. So next one. Pranita, oh, a lot of. <laughs> with message okay sorry we'll see that afterwards uh, now the point is regular students okay and those students who attended now if you are interested you can join i am giving you permission but not to others okay you can send me a message if you want to attend the next session which is the most powerful and energetic session that is session 2 for today session 2 for today i'll send you the link you can message me personally on my whatsapp you have my whatsapp link you can message me you can get my whatsapp and you can message me personally and i'll send you the link and we are going to deal with part a part a finding the answers till now we used learned how to find the answers but now we are going to do finding that till now i taught you theory now i'm going to show you practicals practicals how many of you are interested write your name here write your name here how many of you are interested for part a practical somebody told sir part a i had problem constant smokers i think yeah so how many of you are interested write your name see very good rubina kausar you have to write your second name capital next time if you write small small letter in the anywhere i see you and i'll make you write 10 times pranita pamarthi p capital letter write again okay write again with the capital letter okay next time if you see small letters no i'll make you write your name 10 times huh ushas binu it is two names na no? so separate ushas separate and binu separate write again yeah so i'm going to send you the link afterwards i will have my dinner and i'll send you the link you all can join so request me those who have typed the names request me personally on my whatsapp message my phone number is plus 9198778673600 this is my number and you can take my whatsapp link directly i'll give you my whatsapp link this is my whatsapp link copy link so if you want to send a direct message is to why wasting saving my time send a message directly just click on this link and you get my whatsapp uh, handle and you can send a message to me 
sir i am interested for practical session session number 2 second session i'll send you the link and uh, we are going to till now what we have done we are going to do that exercise now okay we are going to do that exercise now okay how to identify the answers step by step what to do first question or option wait for some people just wait for the audio then the audio starts beep then they look and they forget they did not know anything so what should we do before the beep before the beep what should you do what you are doing going to the battlefield and directly waiting that's not right before night what you have to do you have to sharpen your axe that's what we are going to do okay so be ready within the next any moment i may be giving the link once i have my a dinner and i am going to go through part a perfect clarification if you attend this part a session you will not bother about anything else am vijay jacob will definitely be there i know there with see more i don't know others but am vijay jacob will definitely be there because she used to be there like that and others okay you already messaged me those names who are attending so be there because this is limited edition lecture okay it's a paid lecture not a free lecture but if anybody wants to come those who attended the complete session you can join there okay right meet again shortly